Assalamu alaikum. In this video, I'll show you how to log in with Google in Coordinator project. So I was, what I'll show you in this video, I'll show you how to set up uh, Google Auth in Coordinator project. So let's start. If you're new to my channel, subscribe to the channel and like the video. Open your Chrome. First, I'll show you Google API for PHP. As this is the Google on step or guide to login in PHP for any project. I'll use in this I'll use this in coordinator project. So you need composer for this video to follow this video. So if you don't have installed uh, composer on your system, you need to install this one. I am using composer package manager to install a package. So let's open our project. Project name is YouTube demo. I will use in this project and in this video to show you guys. I will try to follow the same step as mentioned Google documentation. Yeah. So make sure you have installed Composer before executing this command. And our project is open here. You can see I'm starting from very scratch. Only welcome and index here. I'll just show you the uh, login with Google process. You need you can use an uh, to account according to your own the same auth process to uh, save in database and other steps. So this is my favorite ID or editor you can say for PHP development, PHP Storm. So let's execute here the command as mentioned documentation. The first step here yeah. you need to install this package. It will take so this time we create Google console developer account app. Open this. So first we create project here and hopefully Till that time, for this package is installed. So, here I can click here. Click on click on new project. I'm setting the name YouTube demo. Click on create. If you guys need any help while following the steps or any other programming language, any other programming API help, feel free to comment below. Below. So our project is created. Now you need to click here in credentials. Click in here create auth client ID. Your auth client ID. So first we need to here configure content stream. Name your application. I am writing here YouTube demo. As this uh, these are the by default email profile and open ID. I will get in response and we sign up. So click on save. Now here we select web application. Client web app name as our app is 
YouTube demo again. So here you need the project URL with the redirect that as I use my one is YouTube demo. So I'll copy this and paste it here. And we use this URL to log in in Google. So create app. Create. Now this will give us client ID and the secret ID. We need these two to log in with Google. So our installing is in process this will take a little time so what we have done till now we have created a uh, coordinator project we already have installed composer by using this we are installing a package for auth google auth and we created google console app with auth with our client app for login purpose we are getting our client ID and secret ID. So I'm pausing your video here. Till, yeah, this one is completed. This one is completely complete. So our package is installed successfully. Now moving forward to next step. I will use the same controller, welcome, and in the fun index function as well. I just back up some of my code use so what's the next step the next step we need to uh, include this one the package we can install autoload file in our project so you need to copy this from your uh, system as I'm using PHP storm so I have my vendor file is here I need this auto file. I just need relative path and copy and paste it here. Copy relative path, paste. Okay, this is updating well, so that's why it's not copying in my browser in my PC storm. This is the path basically in coordinator vendor auto log. You just need to paste it here vendor auto load. The next step. as we are uh, we are using this one zero auth we need to create client and we i am not using this one uh, just to clear you guys to make it easy for you i am making three variable like here i have used i'll upload this code on github and share the uh, link in the description of this video uh, client ID, secret ID, and redirect URI. We uh, need these three. I'll make one video. I'll make video on this one. You can watch also if you want uh, to use this one. And then we set in, set this these all in Google Client object. You can see client ID and secret key and URI. We need these three and we will get these two from in uh, from the api in response these are called scopes so what's the next next we check we check we have the code how to log in or not if we have this code then we uh, get here now getting there and record this one and if we did not have, have the code and we just echo or whatever you can say 
uh, this one and uh, you can display uh, on view this code client create your uh, create auth url this is the function basically uh, which, which give us the url we uh, need to login so save this and you just need to replace your ids if you are using this uh, this code or this function you just need to replace this this tree first two we get here the client id the second one secret key and the third one we add it we add at this point make sure you are using the same this one this one we added it here so the next one is this now you can see i have set all this function on index file when i click on refresh you can see here we got here google login what i have done here we i just echo an anchor tag and the href the client your the client auth url so when i click on this this will ask for the account to sign in We are getting error uh, here. And define access token. We are getting error uh, here. We are getting some error. Invalidation token. We have done some mistake here uh, while copying the code. Uh, we just copied the wrong one so let's refresh again
so you can see here account name and account email address so make sure you copy the right client id ticket id in the next url i will place this code on github and in my website all around zone and click just enter i'll place uh, drop the link in the description of this video so you can copy this function uh, if you want to use and i'll make i'll make the next video for the uh, this json file uh, process method so good luck guys if you have any query or suggestion feel free to comment below you can use these credentials and like an auth uh, you are doing search session already login and other process for uh, for already sign up so if you want a video on that uh, drop the uh, comment in the description i'll make video on this so good luck guys if you have any query or suggestion feel free to comment below